Hello beauties, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be the power of makeup I'm going to be doing. So one half of my face is going to be all bare. The next is going to be all glam. So let's get started. As always, I'm using my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. And it's just the clear one that I always use. So I'll just... Rubbing that all over one side of the face. It just seems so weird just doing one side. And then I'm going to be grabbing my Wet n Wild Faux Finish Foundation in Buff Bisque. And just putting that on my side as well. And this is how I'm going to divide it. Use it. Oh, that's nice. That's how I'm going to divide my makeup. It is one side like that. And then blending it all in with the original Beauty Blender. And down to the neck. I'm just going to bring you a little closer so you can see what I'm talking about. Just trying to blend it all on my one side, then just blending, blending, blending. And so far, you can kind of see the difference between the two sides. But I'm trying just to make sure it looks all nice and pretty for everything. Just blend, blend, blend. Okay, that's one side of the face finished. Now we gotta go on to Concealer. I can find the concealer. That's great. There it is. Now, I'm just gonna get closer. Just trying to get this so not to crash on me. and then blend that all out and I use the faux finish concealer as well And then I grab the Fit Me from Maybelline in light medium. And I just pack that onto the Beauty Blender. And just make sure everything's set in place.
I use for contour. I sometimes dip into this right here on my angled brush, which is in here. And then I dip into my Becca bronzer here with the same brush and just go over the places I missed. And just to warm it up a little bit more. So that's the Becca Bronze Amber. Thanks. And then I'm going to grab my Tarte blush in Part A right there. And I'm going to grab that on my cute little pink brush. And just pop it on the cheeks. And then I grab my brush here. For it's a little setting spray. Grab the pink right there. Just put it on the high of the cheeks. And I dip into a little bit of that white from the bottom of it as well. And just blend up. Look at that glow. A bit on the side of the nose, one side of the cupid's bow, but mostly on the upper cheek. Okay, now on to eyebrows. I use, I think I took out the brush. I was going to use a brow. Okay. Yep, there it is. I use the, this brand's brow thing, just brush my brows like so and then I grab my Cabrow number 4 from Benefit just pack a decent amount on that and then I sometimes need a mirror for this, so I'm going to use my mirror from the Becca palette right here.
And I dip into also a brow gel. No, not really brow gel, but it's a brow wax. And my cat keeps knocking over things. But it's a little brow wax. I just brush into my brows to make them look less scary. And I just use the mirror that's and put the brow stuff here. Brows look very thick right now. But I'm gonna just clean them up with some concealer real quickly. If I can find my concealer again, that's great. Oh, I found a cap. Oh, wait, found it. So we're just gonna clean this up with some concealer. Oh, no. I went to the back. Oh, there we go. Okay. And I just grab my mirror from this palette here and just blend it up with my beauty blender. And I also just blend the highlight with it as well. For the first time, I'm actually proud of my brows because it hasn't been an easy journey, as you all know, to get these brows how they are supposed to be. So, just making sure. They're looking snatched and nicely. And I'm just grabbing a little bit, a little brush, and a little bit of my smelly, very smelly, Cody Airspun. And just set where the concealer was. Is then I'm gonna go in with the same brush here and grab a highlighter shade from here. Number four is supposedly a highlight in this palette. So let's see. Okay, there there's like no pigment with this. I guess I'm going into my Jaclyn Hill palette here to get it white for highlighting the brow bone. There we go, finally. And I'm gonna make sure everything's blended evenly into the brow. Okay. And now on to eyelid for, for the eyes today. Of course I'm gonna use my shadow insurance. For just because it's my favorite right now for priming. And it just feels very light on the eyes and let me just make sure that's blending all right and now on a nice fluffy 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 brush here right here we're gonna work on an eye look so let's grab my Jaclyn Hill 
palette that you now can see better. And let's grab, we're gonna grab Silk Cream, which is right there. And right there in the palette. Just pack it onto the lid. And then grabbing down from Silk Cream this color right here. On the same fluffy fluffy brush tap off the excess and as well just blend it all over for right now until i can get into the crease i choose a color to put in the crease and i'm just using this mirror Right now it's very muted just with the two colors. I'm gonna dip into, well not dip into, but grab my little precise blending brush here and hopefully there's no, well there is a little bit still, but let's just quickly clean that off and just blend into the two colors. And now I'm gonna dip into this red that's right here. Just a little bit. And that's gonna go outside the crease area. I have so much stuff on the bed right now. So if you hear wrestling, it's, it's me moving stuff around. working with. As you can tell, the power of makeup right now. Okay, we're gonna grab a little bit more from this palette here. We're gonna dip into this color right here just a little and that's going to go on the bottom lid the lash line ever so gently and also just a little bit on the outer corner of the eye here Always make sure with the mirror too, make sure all your lines are blended. Okay. And now I'm gonna grab, hopefully this does not stain anything that I wanna use it on. But I'm gonna dip into a shimmer that's in this palette right here and I'm gonna dip into since it's a pretty dark eye I'm gonna dip into the shimmer here and 
That's gonna go on the lid. And make sure I see where my lid is. We found the eyeliner, and we're just going to do the normal wing I do with Blair London. Liquid eyeliner. And using the same Becca mirror. That is the wing for today. And then I'm gonna put on mascara and a lip and we're almost finished. And again, if it's a long day, I'm very sorry, but And I'm just gonna do a pinky lip. Right here. And this is Hank and Henry. In Pill Pusher. And I'm only doing one side of the lips. So that is the power of makeup for today's video. I hope to see you guys again. Make sure you give this video a like, comment down below, and share it with all your friends. Bye guys.